ZANU PF and Munangago respond to US sanctions. This is a statement by the government of Zimbabwe on the illegal US sanctions. Welcome back to Zim News Live YTS where we give you latest updates about what's transpiring in Zimbabwe. Before we go any further, don't forget to like, subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss any updates from our channel. Zimbabwe has been under United States of America's formal illegal sanctions since 2001 when the so-called Zimbabwe Democracy and Economic Recovery Act ZDERA was promulgated by, by America as a part of a raft of repulsals for Zimbabwe's legal land reform program and as an open and frontal challenge to Zimbabwe's sovereignty as a fully-fledged independent African nation under the United Nations Charter. That heinous act, which the United States of America passed unilaterally and outside the confines and auspices of international law and the United Nations respectively, was given effect through a series of equally illegal effective orders by successive presidents of the United States, by which the United States government sought to make laws and punitive policies for a sovereign African state which it shares neither common geography nor history and against which it has no defensible legal case. All those me measures were illegal and unjustified then. They remain so to this very day and until they are unconditionally dropped. The announcement two days ago on 4th March 2004 by the United States President Joseph R. Biden. This is the news about Monangagwa clearly not in defense of the United States sanctions. Let us know what you think in the comment section down below and please don't forget to subscribe, like and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss any updates from our channel.